speak with Elder Hazel. She'll teach you all about the magic you'll need to write your incantation. Come back to me when you're done. Go speak with Elder Hazel. Come back to me. Tell me, honeybee. Does well are some maybe <laughs> you'll Farseer. I'm sorry, what? Name's Farseer. I see. Far. Like you've got great vision? Visions. Right. Okay. Nice to meet you, Farseer. Go speak with Elder Hazel. She'll teach you all about the magic you'll need to write your incantation. Come back to me when you're done. You did a great job casting your incantation to get your wand branch. But actually writing incantations can be a touch trickier. Yes, I gathered that I have a lot to gather. It's not just that. When you write your incantation, you'll need to draw magic from the wellspring to charge it with power. Draw what from where? Didn't you notice the great big cauldron right by the circle? Yeah, but I just figured it was for extra big batches of potions. Oh no. No, no, the coven cauldron is where we leave offerings for the wellspring. The source of all magic here on the island. Our task as a coven is to maintain the wellspring. We cannot draw more energy from it than we put in. I wrote the incantation you read before the Elder Tree, drawing from my magic reserves. But to craft your initiation incantation, you'll need your own. Go on and offer something to the wellspring. Over time, you will learn that it likes some offerings more than others. Try different things and see what happens. Whoa, so now I can cast spells? Cool! Careful. We must never draw more magic from the wellspring than we need. Our offerings keep it in balance. What happens if it falls out of balance? Nothing for you to worry about, my dear. It is all of our responsibility to maintain the cauldron, and we've never failed in my lifetime. Just remember to leave offerings regularly. Okay, I will. Good girl. Now, you'd better get to work on writing your first incantation. Oh, ho, ho. look at those beautiful squid. Good work, novice. So, when you finish your lunch, can we get back to incantations? No, no, these aren't for lunch. You need to make some nice black ink. And squid ink is the best. Uh, you could have said so. I just did. Now, you'll need a desk. Set it up in your sanctum. Ah, that's your basement. You wouldn't want anyone to happen on your half-written incantations. Once you've got your ink, there's a couple more things you'll need. Come back here, and I'll give them to you.